Hey everybody, it's Alma. Welcome back to Keto Meets Menopause. Hey, hey, hey. Got all these flavored water options, which will make the cut, guys. Check out the song, too. Again. <laughs> all right, guys, check it out. All of these are no no's. This, and LaCroix. Hey everybody, it's Alma. So, getting ready for our June challenge. So I want to give you guys some drinking options. Now, of course, your first option is some good old H2O, some water. Um, but if you need variety on top of your water, because we are kind of used to having some little extras in our life. Well, here's some things that I'm going to be testing. So here's what I have. I have Hint. I have Zevia sparkling waters. I have some LaCroix. I have these Sobe waters and I have this vitamin water zero. So when I am doing the testing every single day, it'll be in the morning. I'll wake up, I'll test my uh, glucose, I'll drink the item, I will wait an hour, 30 minutes to an hour, and if there's any rise in my glucose numbers as a result of drinking these. And uh, so maybe we'll have some options here, guys. Just because it works on my body one way doesn't mean it's gonna work the same way on yours, but at least gives you an, uh, an indicator, all right? So if there's some products that you would like for me to test, and don't put Coca-Cola, guys, because I'm not gonna test Coca-Cola, but if there's some items that are naturally sweetened, with either monk fruit, stevia, and or erythritol, please let me know and I'd be happy to purchase it and give it a test. Sorry about the noise, guys. Little boo dog is down here cleaning his paws. Hi, boo dog. Hi, boo dog. <laughs> oh, that's boo. That's booly, boo boo, boo dog. He's got so many nicknames. And where's Daisy? She's upstairs. They have been fighting all day day in a playful way but still it's just like oh my gosh non-stop it's like your little it's like when you have youngsters at home and they're just like at each other's throats all day so i separated them for a little while all right guys so here's part two of the video for drinks that will be allowed during the month of june challenge before we go into this guys let me go ahead and make a disclaimer my preference for myself my prayer for myself and my hope for you is that we'll turn to this. Not the bottle, not this brand. I'm simply saying water. I showed you guys my water bottle uh, in a previous video. So a bottle with a filter so that you don't have to purchase water bottles would be great. But this should really be your first line of defense for keeping yourself hydrated, guys. All right. So my hope is to get out of the June challenge with using very minimal products. In fact, I haven't told you guys this, but I've already given up coffee, guys. So I am like uh, two coffees in the last three weeks. And when I tasted them, got a hot flash. So my body's way of saying you don't need it, sister. So I've not been having coffee at all three weeks. Oh my gosh, can you believe that? All right, so here we go, guys. Again, water. But if you need to have something, here are a few items that are definitely options. Now, these water drops are by Sweet Leaf, and the first ingredient on these items is vegetable glycerin. And the vegetable glycerin should actually be considered very low on the glycemic index. And because of that, it did cause me some concern as to whether it should or should not be um, included in the month of June. I did reach out to the um, Sweet Leaf Company and they did respond to me. And in the comments, I will leave you with what they shared with me regarding why, uh, how they feel about the vegetable glycerin being included. So here are some items that again, I feel could be appropriate. Uh, there are more flavors than this. This is simply what I was able to get my hands on. This is a mixed berry. This is a tropical punch. This is their Stevia Clear. I also have it in the bottle form. This is vanilla. This would work great for your coffees, as well as caramel, which would also be good in coffee. This is their older bottling. You can see it looks a little bit different. I don't know if they still offer these, but this is their older version. I love this flavor. This is actually my favorite. Their strawberry kiwi, which is crazy because I don't like strawberry kiwi ever, except for in this drink. And I think their blend was the same. I don't think it's changed. All right, next thing is product by Everly. 
And these are stevia based drinks. Let's see if we can go ahead and show you what the ingredients are. Where are they? Where are they? Where? There they are. It is flavor, organic erythritol, and stevia leaf extract um, as the natural sweetener, citric acid, a beta carotene for the color. All right, and here is their product. Uh, they have two forms, different flavors, but two forms. This is just straight Everly Hydration. All right, so this is a sugar-free product. Again, you saw what it had in it. And this has three or four different flavors, guys. I can't remember. You can actually um, go to their website. But this is just their straight drink mix. It actually comes with a little scooper, and you take off the lid, you scoop into the contain into the scooper, and that's how you drink your drink. And this has 30 servings, zero calories. Uh, not a bad option. The flavor on a scale from one to ten, I'd probably give it like a five or six. It's, it's, it's not my favorite, but in a pinch, it'll do. Um, and then there is their energy version. I probably like this a little bit less than I like this. I bought these months ago, guys, and you can see that it's um, it is not been used very often. Why? Because I like the crap stuff better, guys. I did. I'll just be flat out honest. I like my sucralose better. I like my tea better. But that's the old Alma. So guys, here are some items that we can start, that you can use again. Try, try, try. Try and stick to your water. Try, try, try. Stick to your water. In fact, right now, uh, if you have a Randall's or Safeway near you, these are on sale. 24 pack. Uh, five for ten dollars. Anyway, um, I have my water bottle, but I also have my son, and sometimes they're just convenient, grab and go, and usually if I'm walking with a friend, uh, I want to make sure they stay hydrated, so I put two of these in my backpack, uh, just to make sure that my friend doesn't get dehydrated either. So there you go, guys. Again, use this as your first line of defense for dehydration and or keeping yourself hydrated, and the other items use at your discretion. All right, guys, have a very blessed day. See you soon. Bye-bye. Thank you so much for allowing me to spend time with you. If you haven't already done so, please hit the like button, subscribe to my channel, and hit that notification button so that you'll know each time I post a new video. All right, guys, have a great day. Bye-bye. Choice Wednesday is so neato. Now here's my wife to teach us keto. Pork rinds, pork rinds, rah, rah, rah. Carbohydrates, carbohydrates, blah, blah, blah. Kiss my teeth. <laughs>